instantly ordered the military in his own country to attack his freshly constructed home after he witnessed invading Russian soldiers using it as a base to launch rockets into Kiev. Andrei Stavnitsyn, the CEO of the Trans Invest Service, managed to watch via a camera set in his house Russian troops maintaining position on his property and bringing in all kinds of various military equipment. Seeing this, Stavnitsyn submitted the location of his house to the Ukrainian armed forces and urged them to destroy it. It was a sort of a simple choice for me, the billionaire told Good Morning Britain program, and said that he felt disgusted by witnessing Russian troops wander about in his property and use it as a base of operations. Stavnitsyn had departed the nation to Poland but left members of his security team remain at the estate. He went on to explain that his security personnel were held hostage and were stripped and questioned after their phones were taken away. He observed in real time his house being taken over by Russian forces and accused them of robbing neighboring residences as well. He claimed, I noticed that they were literally other houses and bringing items from other homes into my house, and from there loading trucks with TVs, iPads, laptops, personal belongings of other people. I felt disgust. It is disgusting staring at those males going into my house. Stavnitsyn went on to tell Good Morning Britain that he witnessed 12 military trucks stationed on his land some bearing tornado rocket launcher systems. This technology has a range for 40 kilometers, so they were effectively beginning to fire Kiev from my house. The Ukrainian billionaire added that he further went on to complete the interview by declaring, I want to do everything necessary to assist Ukraine win, because I believe we are preserving Europe's safety and it is crucial for us to push those bastards out of our country. It's simply a tiny bit that I could do.